Thank you for do- downloading Friday Night Funkin Doki Doki Takeover. Here's a few things you should know before you begin. Mild episode leprosy warning for the Monica week. Mild horror warning. Get a little spooky. Note that the more note that the more disturbing topics present present in Doki Doki Literature Club are not present in the mod. Yay. <laughs> this mod is best experience if you've played through or watched or watched the game. Story wise, the mod takes place directly after Act 3. The mod is based on a visual novel. There'll be a lot of dialogue. Yay. <laughs> so, yeah. Let's play it. The DDTO team presents, powered by Cade Engine. Just Monica. Woo! <laughs> oh, man. Hello everyone, Marco255 here, and welcome to Doki Doki Takeover. <laughs> I have played the Monica for a week. It's really good. What, 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 what is, what is Sayori holding? What is that? <laughs> I'm, I'm scared. Yo, this is sick. Is it the prologue is just Monica, Sayori, that's thing and that's thing. <laughs> right. Let's just do Sayori, man. Let's just jump into it. Cutscenes. I remember that in the original um trailer thing. <laughs> it appears we have visitors. Seriously, Sayori, you brought a boy to the club? Hey, I wasn't expecting anyone new. We haven't even put out flyers for the club yet. But look, Natsuki, we have another girl too. Empty thoughts. <laughs> if I knew we were exp- if I knew we were expecting more members, I would have asked Natsuki to bake some welcome cupcakes. Oh, and maybe I should have asked Yuri to make tea as well. I need to write this down for later. Plan tea party for club soon. Sounds like you're already very excited about our new guests. You haven't even asked for their names yet. Oh, right. <laughs> Silly me, one of your names, new literature club attendees. Boopski. Happy gesture. <laughs> you two are boyfriend and girlfriend? Oh, you look so cute together. That's cute and all, but like, what are your names? Boopski. Another happy gesture. <laughs> yes, we know you guys are dating. We want to know your names. Beep, deeski, dep. I don't like them already. They're already messing with me. Not too keen, not too harsh. <laughs> I'm sorry about all that. If if you don't if you don't want to tell us your names, that's okay. I'm Sayori. That lovely la- lavender lady over there is Yuri, and Natsuki's the one who's real sassy today. <laughs> with introductions aside, may we ask what these microphones are for? I was just about to ask that. I hope you didn't confuse this place with the music club. Boop-dee. You really want to sing with us? I'm not sure how comfortable I'd feel doing that. Ski dip boop. What do you mean I have to? You know, we've been working so hard on writing and poems lately. I think having a fun singing lesson with everyone is the perfect break we all need. <laughs> when you think about it, songs are just poems with music behind them, aren't they? She's not wrong. They are, kind of. Yeah. <laughs> I bet we'd all be great at this. Here, I'll go first. Yay! Oh man. I think it's, it's the first song, the one we've all heard in the trailers and all. I do not know. I've, I've forgotten. <laughs> oh, it's good to be back to this mod. This has had such an interesting, like, like development this mod. I forgot to do the joke where I say well I'm like bruh this is not on Kate Psych Engine. Damn it. It's <laughs> a nice little song. Yeah like it said at the beginning that flipping that it recommends that you would have played through DDLC and I haven't well, I played through a little bit, like, a couple years back, and I didn't finish it. <laughs> but 
I get the general gist of things. Um, I love that this is, like, not in, like, an 8-bit style as well. It's like... Oh. I didn't expect that. Is it just done now? I, that 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 felt kind of weird. Not gonna lie. See, that wasn't so hard at all. In fact, it was a lot of fun too. <laughs> Did I do a good job? Happy gesture. Beep. Oh, I'm so happy you two are enjoying your time here. It's my duty to make sure everyone in the club has bright, happy smiles. After all, I am the club president. Oh. Okay, then. Oh, this is the one everybody's heard. Yeah, this was the one in the flipping trailer. Yeah, I know that stuff happened in um, DDLC, but like where like the story changed depending on who was there and who wasn't. Because I played that far into the game. <laughs> Where the game reset. Yo! <laughs> that was cool. By the way, I haven't seen any spoilers of this outside of um just just the stuff that's been in trailers and all. Oh. Yeah, that wasn't kind of creepy at all, no. <clears throat> this is rude. This is charming and definitely not not unpreparing me for things to come in the future. I'm definitely going to not be getting jump scared. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh, there she is. What a lovely performance that was. I knew you had it in you. Today has been one of the only real times I've tried to sing in front of strangers. I'm glad that all the practice had paid off. I quite liked the song choice as well. Where was it from? Oh, I... I wrote that song. It's something I spent a lot, a lot of long nights working on. It was meant for someone who means a lot to me. Unfortunately, a lot happened and I lost my chance to sing it to them. I still don't know where I am now, so I don't know if I'll ever get to share it with them. Though I don't know if they'll even want to hear it. Ah, such a tragic story you found yourself entangled in. I can promise that this place is one of no such tragedies. I'll be around when you have a song in your heart that needs to be sang. This guy's awfully flirtatious all of a sudden, especially after he snapped at me that and, th and that kid earlier. Well, if it didn't end up here, it would have been the recycling bin, bin instead. Hope the others are okay. Natsuki, Yuri, Sayori. After what happened, I thought restoring their character files and leaving would be what's best for the club. And for the one I loved. Is something the matter? Ah, I'm fine. I don't know what that was. Yay! So that was the first week. Go for a countdown unlocked. What the? What does that mean? Right, unlockables. Go for a countdown on having have go for a countdown before the song starts. That'll be. I'm I'm keeping that on. Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like this. Like the second song name. <laughs> Right, so we're gonna play through the entire mod in this video. I should have probably stated that. Let's do Natsuki's week with my sweets and baka. <laughs> Sussy baka. Okay, you've convinced me. Oh? You better not tell this to anyone, but I sometimes sing in front of the mirror into my hairbrush. Only when my dad isn't home, though. <laughs> hey, I heard that, you know. It's just picturing you doing that. It's quite an adorable mental image. Shut it! Stop calling me cute. I, I'm not cute. Oh, I shouldn't have said anything. Let's just get this started. 
right. This feels like it's gonna be a mood and a half. Ooh! I love- I like this instrumental. I'm staying silent for this, mate. Like, I want you to listen to this as well. Damn it. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. This is probably my favourite song in the mod so far. <laughs> Better than any of the Monica songs to me. That was way better than I expected. Holy crap. <laughs> <laughs> could, could you keep up with that one? Giggling. Deeple skeet. Ah, stop calling me cute. I don't need boys calling me cute too. That's ex that's extra embarrassing. He's the only boy here, Natsuki. Well, I've been meaning to ask a good friend of mine to join the club as well, but I bet that dummy is just going to join the anime club instead. I knew I should have tried something new. Luckily, music like that isn't the only kind I listen to. If there's anyone who knows how to subvert expectations, it's me. Hit it! <laughs> but that was a mood. Ooh, what's this around the screen? Oh, all right. I really hope nothing creepy happens again, like in the second song of Sayori's Week. I'm trying to set up foreshadowing for something I have no, cl no clue whether it's going to happen or not. <laughs> I honestly kind of expected it to be some sort of, like, heavy metal song. Just by hearing the lines subverting expectations. <laughs> but like, that last song, no, like, I'm, I'm still shocked at how good that was. <laughs> Nothing overly difficult has, like, happened so far. It's just been really fun. Which is exactly what I wanted. And can I mention, like, the dialogue between each song isn't as long as Flippin' Stair Crown, mate. That had, like, tw 20... 20 years of dialogue. For a game, for, for a game I haven't played yet, Gate Tail. I'm not complaining, it's, that's a compliment, if anything, honestly. It probably just means, like, in general, there's a lot of dialogue. Just overall. Nice! Nothing creepy happened, surprisingly. We're gonna get more... ...stuff where... ...Monica and Senpai are vibing, yeah. <laughs> Those girls have been giving me dirty looks ever since I got here. Did I do something wrong? Ah, I see you've noticed my darling fellow schoolmates. I've gotten quite the flock of dedicated fans here. It's only natural when you're the most popular individual in your school. Looks like they're all jealous of you being able to pique my interest so quickly. They'd kill to just spend one fleeting moment with me. Unfortunately, they're just not worth my time. <laughs> 
That's... Mm, you must have your own little fan base where you come from, no? Some people say I do, but personally it feels like everything I did back in my school went completely under the radar. I never, I never set out to be popular though, I just wanted to share my passions with anyone who wanted to listen. And thanks to that, I met my amazing group of friends. Oh, that, um, uh, 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 um... Cool. Ah, did I just see... Why? You're doing that thing again, Monica. You know you can always tell me whatever's the matter. I, I'm okay. Uh, I'm okay. There's no need to worry about me. <laughs> uh, if you insist. But in that case, I'd like to know more about where you're from. You continue to intrigue me with each conversation. I can try my best to do that, yeah. Is something happening that's causing these effects? The game barely kept itself together when everyone wasn't there. If something goes wrong... That was nice, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh. Poems and Thorns, that's a new song. Now we've unlocked Yuri. I'm assuming those two things are for later. Right. I'll play any extra songs we get at the end of the episode. Just because I feel like it just makes sense there. So, without further ado, let's just go to Yuri's week now. Blech, I think I'm done for now. I feel really dizzy after that one. And that's okay. Go rest your vocal cords. Confused glances. Skiddy beep beep dee dee ski. <laughs> well, looks like you're the only one left, Yuri. <clears throat> hey, I know you can do it, Yuri. I bet you have one of the nicest singing voices ever. First, having to read my poems aloud to the club. Now singing too. This club continues to ask so much out of me. Right, I'm pretty excited for this one, honestly. This already feels like a mood. It is a mood. <laughs> oh, this was made by the person who made Evacuate from Friday Night Incident. <laughs> They've made so many songs for so many mods recently. I can tell because it's because of the boyfriend voice. <laughs> so much, dude. It's so good. So good. <laughs> I feel like all my mo all my worries just went away with that song, man. That was so good. God, the first song in in Natsuki's week and the first song in Yuri's week have definitely been the best so far. They've been such moods. Yuri, your singing voice is amazing. Sing again, sing again. I want to hear. <laughs> Are you okay, Natsuki? Blech. I'm not feeling so good. What? I'm, 
not feeling so good. <laughs> Why? No, that was not very nice of you. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna walk Natsuki to the nurse's office. You guys have fun singing though. <laughs> I'm scared now. I'm scared again. <laughs> singing is much nicer than I thought. It's a nice alternative means to relax my emotions. Let's sing again right now. <laughs> Always stressing. I'm scared. <laughs> don't don't do anything scary, please. <laughs> And this is a mood, just like, it's not as mo as much of a mood so far, but still. There's probably pause menu music, but I'm lazy, so I'm not gonna look at it. <laughs> oh, my nose was itchy. <laughs> oh, I'm not pressing that. No, 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 please, no, no, don't do this, don't, no, 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 please, no, no, no. I'm scared. <laughs> what, uh, um, <clears throat> why are we just so chill with this? I'm not, but like, uh. Come back, Yuri and Natsuki, please. <laughs> I'm being very careful not to press these, because those are definitely going to kill me. I mean, I think they kill, I think they kill you when I'm in Monica's week, so yeah. They were added in a reboot. It was a mood, and then it started getting scary. <laughs> I love, I like the design of the, of the, of those notes though. They look really cool. <laughs> Why must we stop now? Let me scream every lyric trapped in my sick head. <laughs> mm, stop. <laughs> you weren't supposed to see that. I appreciate you sticking around for so long to sing with us. You made us the happiest we've been in so long. Stop. Especially after what Monica did to us. Bep. Does her name ring a bell? That must mean you must have been the one who deleted her. <laughs> then you must be the one who brought us all back too. Della Bebski door. Oh, translation. Hold up, I didn't... I knew you and that girlfriend of yours weren't from around here. Your data is so much different. <laughs> well, what is even a .xml anyways? In fact, you two never existed on this computer until just a few moments ago when we first saw you. Could you have done the impossible? Have you broke through to the digital world from the real world? Oh, have you defied all logic and science just for us? <laughs> you, you really have made us so happy. Now that you're finally here, we can all be happy and sing together. Forever. Oh, stop. Stop, please. Forever. Forever. Oh, no, I don't like that. Forever. Terrified beep of noises. That's valid. <laughs> the literature club? I do admit I never fancied myself the reading or writing type. That comes as a shock to many when they all say I have such a way with words. And they're so right. <laughs> that, cl 
club meant everything to me. It was my chance to finally get people invested in this world of endless possibilities that I found myself so engrossed in all my life. It brought people who didn't, who wouldn't have ever interacted with each other together in any other circumstance. Those people became my friends, my best friends, my only friends. Something must have driven you away from all that, to a whole new school for that matter. I was caught up in an epiphany. Nothing in my life was real, and I desperately wanted the one thing that was truly real. I was given a window into something greater, but the world was set up to make, to make me watch everyone else have what was on the other side. My friends, Sayori, Yuri, Natsuki, they were allowed to have the one thing I wanted, so... So you got rid of them, just like you tried here, hmm? I'm, I'm sorry to, to have let my stupid actions carry over here, even when I thought I learned my lesson. Well, you did bring us all back, and as good as ever, no? No hard feelings here. I guess so. I hope nothing wrong happens here because of it. Before I ended up here, I also brought all my friends back, and, and I planned to just stay gone with my data completely erased. So they could be happy. But things didn't work right when everyone wasn't present. If that's still true with me not there... <laughs> Stop! <laughs> I made a mistake. M Monica, what's happening to you? Oh, this is really bad. I gotta... Can you stop doing that, please? Wait, that kid is there too? Tell me, I don't know how him and his girlfriend even got there, but if my friends were acting like this... Code. I gotta, fi I gotta fix this somehow. What in the fresh hell is all this? There's gotta be something. Something. If my character data is acting up too, even from, the even from here... Then there's a chance I still have some res residual data over there. Maybe if I just try this. <laughs> and just like that, the only one to ever truly intrigue me is left in a flash. Ah, oh, woe is me. What am I saying? This shit sucks. Yo, she be- Yo, she be coming real now. It worked. Monica. The game crashed. The game crashed. The game crashed. I'm- I'm really scared. Your songs are available in the free play menu. Monica, but again this time. <laughs> Reconciliation. Did the game intentionally crash? I don't know anymore. Uh. Monica, we've been waiting for you. It's not like you to be this late to a club meeting. It appears that you brought some new members with you too. Seriously, Monica, you brought a boy? Well, at least you found another girl too. And it doesn't make me feel so small compared to the rest of you. Oh, I... Stairs. Hello, you two. It's been a while. I'm sorry for what I did before, and I'm sorry for inadvertently putting you in, t in another situation just like that soon after. But now that I'm here, everything should be stable. I don't expect you to forgive me, but I'm glad you two are safe now. Mm. Scuddy beep. <laughs> you have no idea how, ha how happy I am to hear that. Okay, everyone, I'd like you to meet the newest members of the Literature Club, and I've got a fun way I'd like to introduce them. Hey, despite all that stressful stuff that's just happened, you have enough energy left for one more song. Scuddy beat. Then let's do it. Monica, but she's not in 8-bit. Whoa. She has a different, like, voice now, and everything. Yeah. 
there's apparently one more chapter after this, according to the menu. So there's something else that happens, and I'm scared. <laughs> Flipping like senpai appears in in this or something. And it's like, oh no, gotta get rid of him. <laughs> That's like one of the songs from DDLC. How crazy! <laughs> just started as like a, a flippin' senpai reskin with one song, High School Conflict. And then it's become this. <laughs> it's just had a long ride throughout like FNF's history. From a reskin to a full week to a reboot to an overhaul. <laughs> a lot of stuff has happened to this mod. Conclusion feeling song. But, but, there's, but, there's, but, but there's apparently another chapter according to the menu, so I don't believe in one fucking bit. <laughs> Dual demise. I. That, the festival. What is this? Is that Senpai? So, oh no, is that, oh, is that like the character you play as? So you two must be the other members that Monica and the other girls keep mentioning. They seem to know you quite well, even though I haven't seen either of you at a club meeting before. Well, I guess I did get roped into this whole literature club thing not too long ago. Must have missed when you were around. I'm glad you showed up today, though. Your whole singing thing as the club really inspired. For the school festival later today, they've decided to sing live as their club's special activity. Not sure what singing has to do with literature, but everyone seems everyone seems on board. Can't be upset at that though. I haven't seen Sayori this happy in a while. I haven't even I, I haven't had to go out of my way to wake up to wake her up for school nearly as much as I do since she's right outside with a happy smile waiting for me, humming humming happy tunes. But if you guys didn't show up, I would have had to be the one to sing with them. I'm not ready to embarrass myself in front of my peers like that. Plus, none of them could even figure out a song they wanted to do at. You think you guys can help them out? Happy gesture. Beep. A whole backlog of songs? That should give them all a nice selection to choose from. I'll let them know, with, I'll let them know once they come back from prepping. And I'll see you two tonight at the festival. Alright. Is this the festival? <laughs> Audio's all set up, we're ready to go when you are. Thank you so much for helping us. It's funny seeing you man managing all that music tech. Yeah, you're like your own personal MC. In more ways than one. <laughs> I wonder if that joke works in translation. Oh, you're gonna go first, Yuri? <laughs> I found myself particularly immersed in the story of the track I picked. A song of two young lovers who wander into shady parts of their lively hometown and come face to face with a monster. Wait, hold on. I, I, one ready to to exact the will of God upon them with a chainsaw. Yo, that's flipping. Um, that's Friday night. What the flip? It's literally just Friday. It's literally just crucify. <laughs> it's a crucify cover. <laughs> I didn't expect a crucify cover. I didn't expect to listen to flipping crucify anytime soon. Oh my god. I didn't expect a flipping crucify cover. 
I thought it was just a casual reference to flipping. Mm. Sorry, this bit's just way too good in the original, so I had to shut up. <laughs> SpongeBob. I, I I thought it was just going to be a passing reference to flipping um thing. I thought it was. I literally thought it was just a passing reference to um to Friday Friday Night Fever. But no, it was literally just saying, "Hey, we're doing a flipping crucified cover with Yuri." <laughs> I really didn't expect this. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't think so far. I don't think this is uh, this is bad, but it's still really good. Better, 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 better. Like pretty much every single cover I've heard of a song is not as good as the original to me. I just hear it. I just hear it for the. For, for, I just like think it's just like a nice thing that they that they exist. It's like oh, Amanda Sunday cover. That's pretty cool. I don't, I don't think it's better than the original Madness or anything, I just think it's cool. <laughs> it's what I think about most covers. It does really fit, like, Yuri's character as well, having her sing Crucify. <laughs> <laughs> so there's just going to be a collection of. I feel like she's going to do madness. I don't know why I just got that feeling. Or is it, or is it like one of the Sunday songs? I don't know. I'm going to be honest. There were way too many songs in that list you gave us, and I didn't want to sift through every single one. The song had a picture of a cute cat as the album art, though, so I naturally went with that one. Is it going to be Cappy? Cue the music. Please be happy. It is! <laughs> yes, it's, it's a cover of Beethoven with Natsuki. <laughs> I love Beethoven in the original, dude. Damn, they added doubles. <laughs> yeah, they changed all bit. Well, they carved out. <laughs> Let's go, this is so cool. This is way better, like, I expected it to be great going in, but like, holy shit, this is like, incredible. <laughs> this is gonna be a long video. <laughs> Maybe longer than the Shaggy 2.5 one? I don't know. Oh man, that was so hype. Oh my god. <laughs> Is it gonna be... Yep, I knew, I knew it. There was one song in that list that popped out to me. The song was both happy and upbeat, and yet it felt really sad too. Stuff that's both sad and happy in that way really speaks to me. It's complicated. It's gonna be a cover of It's Complicated from Friday Night Soft. Yes! 
it's true though, it does feel like, like, slightly happy, but mainly, like, sad, and like, yeah, I, I explain my opinions on it in the video, it's a really good song. Although it isn't one that I've, like, listened too much. Uh, pretty much the only songs that I listen to a lot in thing are, um... Like, the songs that I listen to a lot in, in Friday Night Funkin' Soft are, um... Hope, Repressed, and Genesis. Those are flippin' incredible, especially Genesis. That's, like, one of my favourite songs in FNF history. This is so cool, man. I love this. Oh, what the flip is Monica gonna sing? I have no clue. What would fit Monica well? I'm just trying to think of what would fit Monica well. That there's there's a lot of songs we can choose from, so <laughs> oh man, I love this so much. It's so good. It's complicated, it really does feel like it's like boyfriends explaining things to the girlfriend in front of Funkin' Soft is so good. Alright, Monica's turn. There are a lot of songs in that that could have that would have worked for me to sing. I'm happy that you even catalogued all our songs too. But this one in particular, I felt like something people would want me to sing. I think it's the name. Is it like diagraphophobia or something? Oh, Glitcher! Yo! <laughs> Literally my favourite song in FNF history is getting a cover in this mod, let's go. Please tell me that this was made by Ying Yang. Ying Yang as well. But <laughs> who like made the hex mod and I'm still waiting for the for the back for the weekend update in that mod by the way. Whoa, that's so cool! It makes sense that this would happen as well. Da, da, da. Just something about Glitcher in, in flipping in the Hex mod is just, it just gives off that like insanely incredible feeling. It's just, it's difficult to explain why Glitcher works so well for me, honestly. Damn it. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I fucked up.
but like would that flip up the world i do not know would that would like switch into that flip up the entire world and all and also is it okay for us for boyfriend and girlfriend to be in the world as well i i need these questions answered <laughs> do they like leave after the festival or do they stay here I appreciate you two swinging by to help us put on this performance. On behalf of the Literature Club, I thank you. Cherry face. Or oh, cheery face. God damn it. Ski, yeah! Now that everyone's left, there's something I want to ask. You aren't from here, from what I've seen. And you can enter and leave this place very easily now. So I must ask... Is there a way to bring us back with you? This game is very limiting with what we can do, and the others will remain blissfully unaware regardless of what happens. But if they could have the opportunity to see what's beyond their school and homes, I think they would really love it. And maybe, just maybe, I can finally find the one who I've been longing for, and see them face to face. And maybe... Something that's not stated. I'm not going to say anything for these credits, so I'm just going to let them roll. Knew it. Knew it was made by Yang Yang. This mod deserves all the praise it, it needs to get. Like, holy shit, this is actually incredible. Epiphany. We got a new song. We got a bunch of bonus songs to play in free play menu. Let's play them. <laughs> Finally, a moment between us again. You've been busy playing that cute little rhythm game, I've noticed. I'm glad you still thought of me, even though you seemed pretty occupied. No, I noticed because you were working so hard to add me to the game and sing with me. And everyone turning in can watch too. You excited, viewers? Yeah, you excited, guys? Mm, there's only enough space here for us to sing one song. And unfortunately, since this game doesn't have microphone support, we can't exactly sing together. That blue head kid's vocal data is still stored here. Why don't we just use that for you? I want you, I want to sing with you for as long as I can, so I expect this to be very, very difficult. Here we go. Three, two, one, I just didn't press anything else. 
Let's go, I think I beat it! Anyways guys, that just about does it for today's video everybody, I really hope you all enjoyed it. And if you like my channel, oh god this instrumental, <laughs> sorry. And if you like my channel, then why not subscribe, click the like button, check out these videos, share with friends and family, check out my Twitch channel, and click the bell, it's a you be notified when any new videos come out. Anyways guys, I hope you all have a fantastic day, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.